Developing case at criminal court, new evidence exonerated three New Orleans men who were wrongfully convicted of a murder in the 1990s. Now they're suing the city and prosecutors for 28 years behind bars. WGNO's Mallory Smith is at federal court tonight. Mallory. Yeah, Susie, so for more than 28 years, Kunta Gable, Sidney Hill, and Bernal Jaluk were wrongly incarcerated for the 1994 murder of Rundell Santanac, a crime they did not commit. Now, it happened when they were just 17 and 18 years old, but on October 19th of last year, the three men were released from prison after newly uncovered evidence linked the crime to former New Orleans police officers Len Davis and Sammy Williams. Now the three men are asking for justice. Today, they officially filed a lawsuit against the city of New Orleans, the DA's office, along with the individual officers involved. It's amazing that my lawyer was able to file to, um, to get me compensated for what I've been through for the last 28 years of my life, and, uh, and I'm satisfied with that, and I'm looking forward to it, and, uh, and, I'm, and I'm blessed, and I thank God for everything that happened. Davis, one of the officers involved, has been on federal death row for multiple charges. Now, as for Williams, his location is unknown, but he is believed to be living free after testifying against Davis. Now, I spoke to the attorneys in the case. They tell me no future dates have been set quite yet. I also spoke to the men involved who tell me they're relieved to finally be getting justice. But above everything else, they hope that what happened to them doesn't happen to anybody else. Back to you. All right. Thank you, Mel.